Welcome to Miracle Mondays, week two. Today we're talking about awareness. Mm -hmm. That is an amazing word mm -hmm. that embodies so much. So can you tell us a little bit how that um, relates to the work that you do with Yothera? Sure. Awareness is uh, observing what is happening in your body and then connecting it to how that also translates into your life. So m most of the time what's happening in our body is also happening in our life. So I define awareness as connecting those two. Wow, that's a beautiful description. Um, I think that to me, because you're combining both, it's sort of, I think of awareness, I think of having your eyes wide open, which also means if your heart's wide open, mm. then you're, um, seeing from a broader perspective, which allows you to be less judgmental and also aware of how you're reacting or behaving in a certain situation. Yeah. Um, it's the observing might, perspective. It's the observing perspective of, yeah, kind of like that hovering above feeling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, beautiful. Um, when you use awareness in your life, what do you, and how do you approach it? Like, where do you see it come into play for you? Awareness. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's a, I'll have to think on that one. Yeah. It's a, it's simple. Awareness is simple. That's a, that's a good way of saying that. I think we complicate it. So awareness can really just be as simple as my back hurts. Mm -hmm. And I wonder what it has to tell me. I wonder what that pain has to show me. Right. It's really that simple. Yeah. But how often we just skim over those small awarenesses. Yes. I think that's really true. I have one of those. I have a, a neck thing I've had for a lot of years. And when I see it kind of flare up, I'm like, why? What's going on? What's the situation? Am I breathing? Who am I around? It's this thing that helps me to go, okay, stop and kind of reassess. Right. So it's become this natural um, teacher for me. Mm -hmm. We're going to talk more about this and experience this more at the studio through some workshops with Jess. And um, those are in November and December. They're on the MOVE website and Jess's website. What's your website? It's yotherarise.com. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, also stay tuned. Jess and I are going to be pulling a lot of these things together at a special class here on New Year's Day. So don't miss it. We hope you can join us.